to share with everybody where are we at today on Sunday. This is where we're at. Vice President Pence is going to open that door and bring about for the debate for the legislative branch to come in and to entertain. So this is the time for us to get excited, understand that judicially things are closing, and now things are going to the legislative branch. I'm getting calls from all across the United States, from coast to coast, and people are saying, Tex, I was all pro-Trump when you went after the election. <coughs> now I'm starting to get a little down. I'm starting to get a little down. That's okay. Don't be dismayed. The legislative branch is who has ruled President Bush in that election, and it will come down to the legislative branch or the executive branch of government has powers and authority that they will actually exercise. So let it be known here today in Houston, Texas, more than likely it's going to be our executive branch of government that saves our republic. It doesn't matter what the media is reporting about the judicial branch of government because we have three separate branches of government for such a time as this. God inspired men hundreds of years ago when they wrote our Constitution for such a time as this. Why do we have three separate branches of government? Because of such a time as this as we have right here today. So remember that. Nothing is done in vain. Nothing is done in void because our forefathers had the wisdom. Why? Because when you have three separate branches of government, it's all for one purpose and one purpose only. Checks and balances. And this is what we are witnessing today. So do not be dismayed. Be excited. And when you see the executive branch of government, be prepared for the executive branch of government to go ahead and start moving. Okay? So if martial law was to Năm nay đã mấy năm trước mà em nhớ mà bên bàn and President Trump is our president. Thank you, I hope this makes your morning. I want to encourage you guys. Thank you. USA! USA! USA!